In this video we will show you how HIMA changes the tools without any personal interaction between machine tool operators and tool management experts from the tool room. So the operator brings the cart with the used cutting tools to the tool station and picks up the, the cart with the new cutting tools, which are measured and fine balanced, to set up the machine for the next order. Now the operator out of the tool room comes out and picks up the cart with the used tools. So all of this procedure is contactless. So with the Heimer face shield, you protect your colleagues and yourself against droplets and splashes. Now you see the Heimer tool room and Heimer can offer you also for your available space on your shop floor and your requirements the right solution with the cabinets and the machines. Now the operator picks up a new cutting tool which has to be replaced. He is preparing the whole tool cart for the next station to change the milling tools or the cutting tools. So you see here on this aisle we have the manual station for for example collar chucks and on the left hand we have our shrink fit machine. So the next operator picks up the shrink fit holder with the used tool and a new cutting tool as well. In this case we will use our Heimer Power Clamp Premium i4.0 with linear guided coolant bodies, full automatic coil, the vacuum system and our scanner. So you see the, the coil is set it up automatically. He takes the length of the whole tool assembly Now he is heating up the tool holder and changed or is changing the cutting tool. Just fit it in and present it again to roughly the same overhang length like the last tool. Now you see the right coolant position is blinking. Now the light turns red, that means it's hot. Now the light is blinking, that means it's hand warm, you can grab this tool holder and green is completely cooled down. The next station is balancing and presetting on the Heimel Tool Dynamic Preset i4.0. He is checking the balance quality to make sure that there is no influence on the cutting process. Now indexing the tool of 100 on 180 degrees to achieve only the unbalance of the tool. Now there is a traffic light system you see on the right hand on the screen. The green light, it means everything is okay, everything is in the tolerance. And now he's switching to measure the cutting tool. Just looking for the right tool number and measuring the length and the radius of the cutting tool. Now he is printing a label and writing the measured parameters on the RFID chip.
So the another colleague uses the Heimer Microset Violinear machine. This is a full automatic solution for tool measurement. Now you see in the back a RFID device is coming up, reads the chip and automatically chooses the right measuring program. In this case we have a two-step cutting tool and both of them have to be measured. So in the meantime the operator can prepare another tool So we have the ISS spindle, the high precision clamping, so now printing a label, checking the second step, there is also a chamfer which has to be measured to make sure that the contour is right. So now everything is done and the RFID device will write the actual tool data on a chip like tool life, length, radius and another values which has to be or which have to be considered. Now the operator finished to change balance and preset the tools and brings out the tool car to the tool station. Now it's ready to be picked up by the next operator. Now available and ready to order the Heimer Face Shield made in Germany.